All right, it's pretty safe to say that 13 minus degrees is not for me. Like, I can't take it, it's too cold, even though I'm Swedish. So, we flew down to Barcelona, it's 15 plus degrees, so it's a 30 degree difference. How, like, that's just insane. So, it's pretty nice to be out in a hoodie, We're, it's nice and sunny. We are gonna ride bikes here in Barcelona. We're filming for a video for Cannondale, so that's the reason why we're down here. I'm together with Simon, my good old friend and filmer. I'm not gonna tease too much on it, but that's just what we're gonna do. We're gonna film some vlogs, obviously, for you guys as well, but that's gonna be a completely different thing and not the same as in the edit. So, uh, to begin with, uh, we went down to the legendary sea walls at Forum in Barcelona, and it's basically just like natural quarter pipes. It's just unheard of. Like the architecture here in Barcelona is just like someone must have been super drunk or someone must have been like a bike or skater from <laughs> like it's just ridiculous. Look at this, like it's proper quarter pipes in the city and we can ride no one kicks us out anywhere as well like it's just ridiculous so it's good to be out nice and sunny in a hoodie instead of going with like triple layers and a michelin jacket like this oh I, I, simon wanted me to do a freaking fufanu here and it's concrete like i'm gonna just ruin my cranks and bike oh shit. <laughs> Oh. oh! Was it a cheat one? Was it even on the on the edge? Uh, no. No? No. Ah, got it. That one? Yeah. Yeah. Like Simon is the biggest geek of turnouts of all my friends. Like he's the reason why I started doing them. Like I used to be against everything with turnouts, but then like when I broke my arm and came back, I was like, well, I might give it a go. And turn down <laughs> in the wall, just uh, air. Air. Yeah. I'll do it both ways for you. It's fine. Yes. Yes. You like that? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's cool. It's got something going there. Eh. Oh. Oh. Okay, okay. I don't give a damn if that was sketchy or <laughs> shitty. Gonna keep it in the vet anyway. I'm not really sure what I want to do here. I, I got an idea. Let's launch over that, like, or into it. Like, tr I'm gonna try to sprocket rail that tree. It's just oh, gonna be. Oh, you know? Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. gonna go like that, and then. Okay. And then a trick in a quarter. Uh, wow. A better one. Uh, <laughs> Cool. So random and so like, what am I doing? But I'm just like keen and stoked because we got a really sick clip here. Yeah. But it didn't come easy. Like, I, uh, yeah, just roll a clip. That was a bit of a party pooper. Then you guys understand how my ankles and wrists are feeling if my tire pops up. No, no, no. Absolutely no. I managed to screw up my finger and my tire exploded as well. So I got Simon here to pump it up. We had to go to Decathlon to buy a pump. And uh, yeah, so that's a bit of a mission. We're missing maybe like an hour of filming now, which is quite crucial. We don't have that much time here in Barcelona. So work fast. <laughs> but yeah, so we are back again. And then as soon as we got back, actually, I crashed on flat ground. Hey guys, if you're excited for my video, there is coming. Well, I just crashed on flat ground. So maybe you don't have your hopes too high because I just did a cool trick and I'm super stoked about it. Then I crashed on flat ground just pedaling. So, ow, how can it hurt that much from just crashing on the ground? Every, well, I was going quite fast and pinned and then just washed out on asphalt. Uh, so much pain everywhere. Why? <laughs> All the time. As soon as I get something good in life, Someone's just there to knock me down again. <laughs> and here's some sort of... Oh. Ooh. Oh, a bit of a... <laughs> oh. <laughs> that guy was stressing for no reason. English. English. 
What? I'm a policeman. What? I'm a policeman. Yeah, uh, I'm not right. Oh, okay. Okay? No worries. We'll leave. What? Okay. Okay, so that guy claimed that he was a policeman and I have no rights to be here. And it was really a very, very stressful honking for just being very far away from me. But imagine if that guy saw us in New York, he would have shit his pants when we went through traffic. traffic. But yeah, I guess we're gonna leave now because he literally told us to leave and we have no rights to be here. So tough shit. We uh, shouldn't really distress. Oh no, my money! We shouldn't really disrespect the police when we go to a new country, so we'll do what he says. Another legendary spot with all these like crazy bumps with the most tight transition you'll ever feel in your whole life if you ride them. But uh, they're too cool to not be ridden. We're not gonna use it for the edit though, so might as well do some vlogging on it. Manual all the way, bar into this. Nose three on this one and then a foot jump whip. The foot jump whip is gonna ruin the whole thing and I'm gonna be so angry, but... <laughs> Told you, it's actually, it's never gonna work. I'm never gonna be able to do that whole line. I'm, ju I'm just gonna do. <laughs> Watch this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay. So graphical. Okay. <laughs> Fun and all, but super, super random. Such a random day, isn't it? <laughs> we are going to the next spot. Sometimes you gotta give back, take photos for other people. <laughs> Should get this line going then. Yeah. yeah. We're at the most legendary dirt spot that we have in Europe. It's called La Puma Bike Park. Uh, this place has a really, really big place in my heart. I spent a tremendous amount of time here. We're gonna take you guys along with the new stuff up there. They've rebuilt all the mini trails. Endless lines there, so uh, yeah, I'm gonna smack on the GoPro, take you guys along, and then we're gonna film a couple lines. Uh, yeah, <coughs> leave a like, subscribe. Oh no, sorry. <laughs> sorry about that, but yeah, let's get into the video. Right, left, right, left. Yeah. Okay. I just wanted to ride the little lines today and uh, tomorrow we're gonna move on and ride the NBA and the big lines and hopefully the airbag as well. Uh, quite exhausted after a couple of days of riding streets so uh, it was fun to just play around on these, have a good time with the boys and we'll catch you back here in paradise, La Pone Bike Park tomorrow in the morning or yeah, some, yeah, yeah, yes. All right, it's the morning after, we're back at La Puma Bike Park. Uh, the lines are actually closed because we got here bright and early in the morning, as you can see, and uh, yeah, it's just a bit too windy, so they closed out the lines. Uh, I don't know when they're gonna open them up, but we decided that we're not gonna waste any sort of time when we're down here 
in the sunny Barcelona. It's just so nice with sun. But anyways, we're gonna go ride some street instead, get some more clips for the edit and uh, bring you guys along. See what we do, I don't know. I have no idea what you think. <laughs> All right, we got a bit carried away with the street riding. Uh, well, obviously that's the reason why we're here. We, we need to film a street segment because in two weeks we're coming back here to Barcelona to film the third segment. Sun is setting. We're just gonna enjoy the sunset a little bit more. And then we're gonna ride a skate park here behind me with all the boys. And uh, I'm gonna try to get them to eat one of my spicy nuts. Not my nuts, but yeah. <laughs> we're gonna ride the concrete park because it's lit up as you see, because it's right here like you can see what I'm doing and stuff so uh, tricks maybe manuals and stuff yes first thing without even touching the ramps I'm gonna hop up this thing and do a bar mani and then bar on the hip over there okay never gonna work first try but we'll see Yeah, <laughs> not really first try, was it? <laughs> I got a trick that I wanted to learn. I want to do like an oppo three foot plant thing. I'll show a regular one and then I'll show a try of the oppo, but it's gonna be horrible. <laughs> that was not really the try, was it? But, but then oppo is just so horrible. Wrong foot and stuff. I've never been a good soccer player with my wrong foot, so. We'll see how it works. Your yeah. face tells me that it won't work. I'm, I'm saying yes, but I, I mean no. Okay, cool, thank you. <laughs> Thanks for the belief. <laughs> oh. Okay, it did work, didn't it? Sure shut me well, up. Well, I shut you up, but uh, at the same time, I look like a complete grom. Push just this high above the ground and just like eh. what the? Do you want to tail up off this ledge and then land on a very very skinny amount of concrete here so yes possibility of doing a tail up to firecracker and over the bars oh. like I've been running street today this is not what my body wants the turn over there I'm just turning around it's the sickest thing I've done all day come and look at this just like this oh. <laughs> that little fly out they have here it yep. could be nice to land a bit more flat you know 180 double B oh no don't call that it's so hard oh. it did work okay but it was a lucky shot Like this is so heavy and so tech and so hard for being this late in the in the evening and we had a big day already. But manual up the ledge, so and then bar from the manual, land manual again, and then something out. Cause why not make it so hard for myself when I can literally do a couple of tricks and have a good time? Oh. Oh. <sighs> we brought out the tube of terror. Uh, it's supposed to be a death nut challenge, so it's 16 million Scoville, and we're gonna try to get Lucas Schaefer to eat one, because why not? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get someone to eat it for my video. Did he eat one at least? Yeah, I have done one, yeah. But the challenge is to eat all no. of yeah, it in 10 yeah, minutes, yeah. So, so it should be possible to eat one, right? Yeah, yeah, it is. I'm getting. It's <laughs> 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 getting worse, right? I thought the worst would be done, but it isn't. I think it's. Wow! You want water? Now it's heavy. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know the Scovilles and stuff? Uh uh. No? I think it's 16 million or 13 million Scovilles. Yeah. So it's quite a lot. <laughs> well, if it's called Tube of Terror, you're taking it like a champ, though. I didn't thought it would be that horrible. No? I think the worst is... Ah, it's getting worse again, right? 
<laughs> How spicy is it though on a, like a scale? Like one to ten? It's so heavy to breathe normally and <laughs> it's like burning so hard in the throat. <laughs> Did I have to take one? <laughs> <laughs> it's like Lucas just had it. He took it like a champ, though. Just, just bro. Probably can't touch my finger. Like, no, you shouldn't touch your finger off, though. Bro. <laughs> ah shit. Nah, I'm not slow. As a match, I'm actually going to do it. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Already? <laughs> yeah. He, he told me it's fine. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no. Ah. Do we have some ah. bottle over there? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ah, yeah. oh really? I, I thought